The information in this video is based on unsubstantiated information, but the source Kitty Corgi has no history of leaks and only a few tweets. It is possible that none of this is true, and I end up looking like a fool. But with that out of the way, if this particular rumor is to be believed, NVIDIA's flagship GPU will have a massive 826 mm square die. While the process node was not mentioned, a die this large does slightly increase the probability of it being on the older, more mature node like 12 nanometer VenFET. However, depending on how mature the TSMC 7 nanometer is, an 826mm squared large die isn't totally out of the question for limited quantity runs there as well. Now here's where things get interesting. The rumor does include a block diagram which indicates improvements in the architecture and Nvidia doubling down on their RTX strategy. The last part isn't particularly surprising as the RTX portion of Turing is relatively tiny and limited in the scale of application to RTX games. A 826 mm square die on 7 nanometer would absolutely be enormous and insanely dense, and this wouldn't be entirely uncharacteristic of Nvidia considering the company has pushed the power and thermal envelopes before with their higher end parts. Now, taking a quick look at the improvements listed is int32 units remains unchanged, but doubling the FP32 unit for shader proportion. The performance of the new Tensor Core is doubled, and enhanced L1 data cache is more comprehensive and has more comprehensive functions. See true architecture for RTX gaming with all new designed RT Core Advanced. Now the last bit is something that sounds straight out of Nvidia's marketing material and is something that makes us think that this just might turn out to be true. Now RT Core Advanced is also a very plausible naming scheme coming from what appears to be a non-native English speaker. Now consider us intrigued at the very least, although we would still advise copious amounts of salt to go with this. And for more on this and the leaked specifications of the RTX 3080 Ti and the RTX 3080, follow the link down in the description and make sure you're subscribed and hit that notification bell so that we don't miss you and the next one.